is up guys it's Matt from School Bus and today we're doing another collectible guide and this one is called the tourism guide um, so pretty much I've got a few already but I'm gonna go over them anyway only number 11 which is the Sherman's camp brochure is unmissable to the storyline uh, this is you can only, you can get this in region 3 I forgot what mission but in region 3 you definitely get this so that's the only one that is unmissable. So let's get straight into it. So this is the first one. Uh, this one's called Old Pioneer uh, something brochure. So it's just here by the cemetery. The cemetery is easier, but you just got to clear out the nest. But there's the first one, and that was called. This one's called Old Pioneer Cemetery brochure. So on to number two. So for this next one, this is my second one, but for the first one for the uh, Old Pioneer Cemetery brochure, that was the only one in the Cascade region, so we're in the Belknap region, and we're going to go region by region so it's easier uh, for you guys to understand. So this one's called the Frontier, uh, Frontier Motel brochure. I forgot what they're called. So go to the tent uh, motel, and it's just the first one to the left. Go through the door, and that's when it, uh, not through the door, through the window, and it's just there to the left, as you can see. I don't know what it's called, but we're going on to the next one. Right, this is the ninth one, so you just did the tenth one, this is the ninth one. So the, the motel, next to the motel, you got the fuel station at Crazy Willis. And this one's called Seeking a Gorgeous Man, or Seeking a Gorgeous Man. So what you're going to do, you're going to come into the uh, fuel station and it's just here. I think I've collected it here before the mission, so I think everyone else has. But it's just there, that one right there. So the next one is at Hungry Gym. So it's next to the fuel station at this place. I always forget what it's called. Uh, but it's the big town in the Belknap region. Uh, probably the quickest way if you're travelling down from the Cascade Cemetery. So this is the Hungry Gym's menu. So I think I've already picked this up as I was doing the story missions, but I'm going to show you where it is anyway. It's just here on the desk. Uh, that's not the correct one, am I? Right, guys, this is number three, and this is next to the big church in the Belknap region in the big town. So this is called Marion Fox Bumper Stickers. So what you're going to do, you're going to clear out the nest in here. I don't remember where it is precisely in here, but there is a nest that you got to burn out. And it's just here. Alright, so if you go back into the Marion Fox, this is number four. And this is the polk postcards this time. And it's just right here to the right. So this is number eight. This is the Belknap Fire uh, Warning Season sign. Fire Season Warning sign. That was close. This is number eight. And this was just... Uh, coming up to the cliff side uh, as you're following them down to the main junction or even next to the blue ambush so this is number eight the uh, Belknap fire season warning sign so this is number five and this is called the benefits of Bear Creek hot springs so this is part of the ambush uh, area in the Belknap region which is at pretty much full north so you could probably come across this uh, when you're doing the second chapter of the game it's a bit difficult this one but it's right here so this is number seven for the tourism so this is called bears wear black bear poster awareness bears wear black bear awareness poster yeah I was, I was right so this one is just on a, a toilet door, but this is next to the uh, bridge that is broken that you can't get across. Also, it's next to the uh, ambush and Nero facility if you're around there. Uh, so that's what it is, just by the bridge, that's your aim uh, references, and it's just on the wall there. Okay guys, this is number six, and this is called Salmon Hot Springs Guest Book. So this is uh, pretty much you want to go off uh, Tucker's camp and it's just the biggest building on the map as you can see what you're gonna do you're gonna jump through the window so there's the entrance and there's the other entrance so this is salmon hot springs guest book 
Okay guys, we're in the, uh, the region off Lost Lake now. Uh, we've done Belknap and Cascade. So this one's called Sherman's Camp Farmer's Poster. I think so. This is number 13 on the list. Sherman's Camp Ma oh, Market Poster. I was close. Okay guys, this is the 26th one on the list. So this is called Adam's Finch stout label so this is bottom of lost lake near the infestation site and nero site uh it's the big house so what you're doing you come in this side entrance uh also you could go in the front entrance the side entrance is the closest side so you want to go to the pool and then come to the bowling uh, pinball machine i think it's pinball and it's just here on the wall Okay guys, this is number 14 on the list. This is called Rogue Camp uh, Whiskey Menu. So this is in uh, the town, the south region, uh, the south town of the Lost Lake region. So you're know, coming into this blue building, which is the uh, whiskey bar, should I say in this case. And it's just here to the right. Okay guys, this is number 12 on the list. So this is called Meet the Cadets. Uh, Campfire Cadets, sorry. So this is just on the table to the left. Okay guys, this is number 27 for the Tourism Collectibles. So this is called Snowbrush uh, Alpaca Farm. I probably butchered that. Snow. Snowbrush Run Alpaca Farm, number 27, Tourism. So that is in the Ripper region, Iron Duke region. Also, you can get the historical marker here, and there's a barn. For your point of uh, reference, it's near the Nero site in the uh, Ripper region. Right, guys, this is number 25 for the Tourism, and this is called Iron Butte Ranch Master Tournament. So you need to go to the petrol station in the region, uh, Ripper region, also near the Ripper site, uh, not the Ripper site, Nero site, sorry. And also the, the last location is just up there, so just next to each other for this one. And it's just here. Okay, this is number 28 for the tourism collectible, and this is called Classified Research. So you need to go to the research facility in the Ripper region, and I'm just going to speed this up for you guys. Okay, guys, it's just right there. It's just that piece of paper. I collected it before uh, when I was Final. doing the... Jesus. Okay guys, for this one it's number 17 on the Tourism Collectibles and this is called a Fisherman a Fishing at Diamond Lake Village. So what you need to do is go to Crater Lake and it's just here and go to the Diamond Lake and it's just this one on here. Okay guys, this is number 15 and 16 for the Tourism Collectibles so your reference is Either the Nero site, you're going to fast travel to that, or the camp, or the Wizard Island, or the Nero facility that's further up here to get here. Because you can't go anywhere else, you've got to go a long way, or even go to the college instead. So it's the visiting centre on Crater Lake, so this is 15 and 16. 15 is preserving the beauty of Crater Lake, and it is this one right there. Number 16 is Crater Lake. Poster, so it's in the other part of the visiting centre, and it's just here on this table. The base, there it is, right there. Okay, guys, this is number twenty-three on the tourism collectible list, and this is called Chamont Ski Resort Brochure. So the location is at the very top where the ski resort is in the Highway ninety-seven. And you're looking for this building uh, the best place to get here is via the ambush camp or even the Nero facility in Lost Lake so once you come in it's just to the left and it's here on the till
Right guys, this is number 18 on the Tourism Collectibles and this is called Subsfest. So the best place to get to the Chimol uh, fi uh, fuel station is via the ambush or even the college. Uh, but it's at the fuel station where the Chimol hoard is, box hoard, and it's just uh, next to the fuel station and it's in here. So I'll just go to the left and it's just right here. Okay, this is number 20 on the tourism collectibles and this is called Take Out and Tune. So it's next to the fuel station, as I said, uh, in the Chamalt area or town. The best place to get there is via the ambush camp. So what you need to do is just the fuel station, just the other side of this truck, uh, come to the auto repair uh, building, mechanical building, whatever you call it, the garage, and it's just right here, that one there, and that's number 18. It's at 21 on the collectibles for tourism and this is called Pet Parade. It's next to the fuel station and the auto pair. It's just the same location in the Chamalt region, uh, town sorry. Uh, the best place to get there is via the ambush and it is in the ranch and feed. So this is Pet Parade number 21. Okay guys, this is number 19 on the tourism collectibles and this is called Balloons Over Chimol. So the location is next to the fuel station, all pairs and the last one was the pet parade and the feed and ranch. So the best way to get there is via the ambush camp or even the college. It's below the uh, train track in the Chimol town. So you need to go to this little house. There's a bit of a reference for you near the bus. And it's just here to the right. Okay guys, this is number 22 on the tourism collectible uh, list. And this is at the Chamal Community Centre, uh, College, Community College. So this is called Chamal Community College Green Week Poster. So all you need to do is just come to the right of the community college and it's just here. And for the final one this is called Kalmar Marsh Wetlands Preserve Flyers and this is number 24 on the tourism collectible list. The best place to go is uh, via the ambush camp at the bottom of highway 97. And it's just right here on this like little ball sack of an uh, coast or marsh, should I say. And it's just here on this signpost. Thank you for tuning in. Stay tuned for more. And I'll see you all soon. Adios.